Hello, my name is Warren Dick and I want to give a brief introduction of myself before explaining why I think it is so important for you to become involved in submitting your reviews for our society journals. I served six years as editor of the Journal of Environmental Quality, six years as editor-in-chief of the Soil Science Society of America, and six years as editor-in-chief of the American Society of Agronomy. As such, it has given me a front row seat, so to speak, of the importance of manuscript reviewing in maintaining the quality of our journals. Now, in addition to the administrative roles I have played for our journals, I have also been very much involved in submitting my own reviews. For many years of my career, I would strive to submit at least two reviews a month, and in my later years, I did up to 50 manuscript reviews in a year. Of course, this took time, and it was three to four hours of time involved, concentrated time for each manuscript review that I would submit to a journal. I think it is especially important, however, for younger scientists to get involved in this process. And let me give you a few reasons why. One, it really helps keep you involved in your scientific professional societies. It helps you become known and to know what others are doing. Two, it helps you maintain the most up-to-date information within your scientific discipline. Three, it can help in your own writing. I know it has helped me tremendously over my career to observe how others put together manuscripts and how they write and the importance of uh, being focused and, and having a good abstract in writing. Four, I think you'll get a tremendous sense of accomplishment in becoming a, an accomplished reviewer and, and submitting to the activities of our society. Now, I think it is important that, that we not only su submit reviews for our own journals, but I'm sure you will be asked to submit reviews to other journals, and that is very appropriate. The question is, well, how many reviews in a year should I try to accomplish as a young scientist? And my suggestion would be to try to do one review a month. If you are very much involved and active in publishing, you might say your goal should be to submit one review for each manuscript that is submitted for review. Now, I believe that if you were involved in this type of activity for our society journals, I am almost certain that the editors and the editorial boards of our journals would be very, very pleased. We have two new journals, the Agricultural and Environmental Letters and Agroecosystem Geosciences and the Environment. Uh, both of these are newer journals and they would be very pleased to have you contact them and offer your services at a review. But all of our even more established journals can also always use more reviewers. I hope you are involved and that if you are not, you will become involved in submitting reviews to our manuscripts, to our journals of manuscripts, and our society, our editors, our editors-in-chief will be very thankful and you will help maintain the quality of our journals. Thank you.